The bladder, a hollow, muscular organ designed for one purpose, control. It sits low in the pelvis, quietly collecting what the body no longer needs, stretching slowly, patiently, without drawing attention. Every minute, the kidneys filter the blood, sending excess water and waste down narrow tubes into this expandable reservoir. As it fills, the bladder adapts. Its walls stretch. Pressure remains low. Signals are delayed until the timing is right. This balance is precise. Too much tension and urgency appears. Too little coordination and control is lost. The bladder listens constantly, communicating with the nervous system to decide when release is appropriate and when it must wait. When the moment arrives, muscle layers contract, valves relax, and the system empties efficiently, completely, by design. But the bladder does more than store and release. It reflects hydration, kidney function, and nervous system health. Stress can tighten it. Calm can steady it. Routine trains it. Though simple in appearance, its timing requires cooperation between muscle, nerve, and brain. A process learned early in life, maintained quietly for decades. The bladder is not just a container. It is a regulator of balance, timing, and restraint. It holds what must be released until the body decides it is ready to let go.